welcome back to my YouTube channel, Inspiring Varatha. Friends, today we are doing yoga. Friends, yoga is very important for our health. Friends, do you think yoga is only for elders? No, yoga is for kids also. Friends, the benefit of yoga are our mind will be peaceful and healthy. We can do all things with positivity, art, homework, going to school, enjoying park, and everything. We'll also teach you the yoga poses, also called asanas. So, friends, let's start. Friends, before starting yoga, we will do some warm up and stretching exercise. Whenever you start yoga, don't forget warm up. So let's start with warm up. slowly rub your hands put it on your eyes just feel relax and now we are going to start yoga sukh asan so friends now we start with easy sitting pose we call it sukh asan sit on the ground with the back straight cross your leg bringing the knees towards the ground the hands can be on knees facing up or they can be together at heart center this pose can be held for multiple breath or when meditation breathe in breathe out breathe in breathe out breathe in breathe out you can do it multiple times do you know the benefit yes maintain a perfect body posture help you in growing taller it calm your mind so we call it sukh asan trikonasan now move on an other asan that's called trikonasan stand straight with your legs apart inhale exhale inhale exhale do it multiple time and simultaneously slide your left arm down along your left leg till your finger are at your ankle at this point your right arm must be horizontal your hand is tilted left hold the pose with your knees and elbows straight then change the position and stand straight now stand straight and back to normal take breath in breathe out and relax to your body so benefit of this yoga is improve digestion and strength your leg foot and neck 
improve alignment and stability so this asan is very good for digestion and strengthness of your body that's called trikonasan or vakrasan so now let's move on an other asan that's called vakrasan stand straight lift your right leg on keep it on your thighs for a support straight stretch your both the hands up and join stand the same and close your eyes relax your mind and slowly inhale exhale back to your position so this asan you can try multiple time if you can't hold your position for long then you can do it multiple time but if you will do practice then definitely you can hold for a long now come on the benefit it assist you in getting more stable patience and flexible enhance concentration and focus which is very important for kids studies improve the focus of mind so kids please try this asan and do it on regular basis to make you focus for studies balasan now next move on balasan So you start on the hands and knees sit on your hand and knees like this and take your position of balasan press the hip back towards the heel down your head like this the arm can be stretched out of the body front side and crawl down by this side This is the position of balasan. Now move on your normal position. So benefit of balasan release any tension or pain. Stretching spine tight. Also good for sleep. So kids balasan is really good for kids. पश्चिमोत्तम आसन नाउ लेट्स मूव ऑन नेक्स्ट आसन पश्चिमोत्तम आसन सो फ्रेंड्स टेक योर पोजिशन ऑफ पश्चिमोत्तम आसन ब्रिंक द लेग्स आउट इन फ्रंट ऑफ द बॉडी लाइक दिस नाउ stretch your feet bring the arms up and fold towards as far as comfortable if the feet cannot be reach reach for the leg hold for a feet and take a breath feel relax while doing this asan now back to your normal position so benefit of this asan is reduce anxiety gets you a good night sleep same as in balasan it's also good for the sleep help in correcting a bad posture the main objective of this asan is of the good posture position posture or position of your body bhujang asan now let's move on next asan bhujang asan start on the belly take your position of bhujang asan like this Now bring the hand flat to the ground under the shoulder using the back muscles and the core lift up like this 
This is the position of Bhujang Asan. Hold the pose for a few breaths. Take breath out in, out in. Now back to the normal position. The benefit of Bhujangasan is open the heart and lungs, strengthens the spine, stretch chest, lung and shoulder. So this is very good asan for the kids as well. Ustrasan. Now let's move on. Next asan, Ustrasan. Stand on the knees. Take the position like this. Keep the thigh fully straight. Keep the knees and feet together. Learn in the backward direction. Slowly move more backward reach like this position. Right heel with the left and avoid straining the body. Push the hips in the backward direction. The thigh should be kept vertical like this. Then bend the heel and the spine and the backward and as far as possible without straining like this. Relax the body and the muscles of the back. Now back to your normal position. Benefit of Ustrasan is strengthness of back muscles, improve posture, stretch the entire front of the body. So Ustrasan is also very good for the kids. Parsvottan Asan Now let's move on next Asan that's called Parsvottan Asan. Stand straight and take the mountain position like this. Then spread your legs and slowly down your hands and take side back side. Join your hand like this. Open your leg while joining your hand to backward. Now stretch your body in the one side then another side. Stretch your body as much you can. Then take normal position. You can try this asan according to your body flexibility. Benefit of Parsvottam Asan is calm the mind, improve balance and digestion, strengthen the legs and the care of your legs. Virbhadra Asan Now let's move on next Asan Virbhadra Asan Stand and then take your position, open your leg, then bend your one knee and straight your hand like this. Look at your side of bent knee. Lift your arms sideways until they reach the high of your shoulder. Your arm must be parallel to the ground. Now take the normal position. So benefit of Virbhadra Asan is balance of body, helps to increase stamina, helps to release stress and relax the mind and the body. Shav Asan Now next move on the last Asan. We call it Shav Asan. Take the position for Shavasan, sit on the floor, then lay it flat on your back, legs should be spread. 
then keep your arms at your side and your palm facing up relax your body and lose your body for feeling relax take breath for relaxing whole body think about all the parts are relaxing in the body this asan is very good for relaxing after complete your exercise now back to your normal position slowly slowly then stand on floor friends i'm feeling so relaxed after yoga friends same you are also if you will do yoga you will feel so relaxed so friends where are you going first like my video and subscribe my channel bye